Schools in Danbury, Connecticut will now start the year with remote learning after an increase in coronavirus cases in their city. CBS 2's Alice Gaynor live there now with the latest. Alice. In addition to schools, the boat launch for Candlewood Lake is closed. Youth sports canceled. Officials believe they've figured out the cause of the spread and also say that the recent tropical storm and extended power outages pushed people together and may have made things worse. Seven-year-old Tyson and his uncle just got word he'll have to start the second grade remotely. It will complicate things, but, you know, his uh, education is very important, so we'll make the right, you know, moves. Schools will be all remote, effective September 8th, and then we'll reevaluate and potentially move to uh, uh, a system of hybrid uh, by early October. Western Connecticut State University in Danbury says classes will begin remotely there, too. Sports fields in the city have also been shut down to youth and adult leagues. Over the last two weeks, we've had about 240 positive cases here in Danbury. And to compare that to the previous two weeks, we had about 40. So there is something going on. Officials say contact tracing helped them zero in on the spreading happening at sporting events. I was at games on Tuesday night. Parents didn't have a mask on. Kids on the bench weren't wearing a mask. Nobody was social distancing. I mean, that's a problem. Also, places of worship and small family gatherings where people weren't social distancing or wearing masks. Many of the infected people, they say, traveled internationally and domestically. Governor Ned Lamont says despite what's going on in Danbury, he doesn't believe other parts of the state need to switch back to remote learning. The infection rate here is 6 or 7 percent, which is, I hope, a short-term spike. The rest of the state is down around 1 percent. So if Connecticut cannot open its schools, at least for the younger grades for in-person learning, you can't do it anywhere. The city is urging people to come get tested. This line you're looking at here, that's a line of cars. That's a study line that's been here all day of people coming to get tested at the Rogers Park Middle School. The city of Danbury has a list of locations on their website. You're urged to check it out and come get tested. Live in Danbury, Connecticut, Alice Gaynor, CBS 2 News. Alice, thank you.